Hey, uh, so I have my lunch. I normally get the breakfast and then I normally get breakfast, but they missed the breakfast today. So look at, I want to show you what I'm what I'm working with, what I'm doing here. So I have these containers, right? Because you know I have all of my greens here. I have my, ooh, my spinach. It's very important to eat a lot of greens, and I can't do my juicing from home. I have that. I have my celery. I have parsley and whatever else that is there. More greens, right? I have these containers. This is the lunch. Lunch is here. This is the lunch that you was. You see that? This is my lunch, and. This is lunch that they provided for us today. Chicken, brown rice, and I think that's squash. Now from my research, we're not supposed to be eating poultry. You know, I watched Dr. Day, she said she stayed away from all of those things. Chicken, fish, and all the meat. She didn't, she didn't do it, right? Even though it's so daggone tempting right now, I am going to, um, I cut this part of the cover off. I cut this part off. I'm gonna put the spinach in here. Um, and the rest of the stuff I'm gonna put in here and wash it, so I'm gonna continue, I'm gonna keep this. I got me some al alkaline water. I always bring the alkaline water back with me. Okay, so I have a bottle of alkaline water. I'm gonna take everything in the bathroom and go wash it. I'll be back. Okay, so I got, um, this is what I got done. That, this is what I'm going to be eating. I'm going to have my cabbage. I'm going to have avocado. And avocado, I'm going to squeeze a lemon in it. And I have some garlic in here. Oh, yeah, I have some garlic. Garlic is good, right? And I'm going to have it with this food here. I'm not going to eat the chicken, because chicken we shouldn't be eating, no poultry. And I'm going to eat the rest of the vegetables. And then there's some soup here. And my juice. My point is, you know, I'm not sure if they're all organic, but I probably think they treat their soil and the fruits, vegetables a little bit different here. But it doesn't even matter. I'm going to do what I have to do. I'm going to... You know, you know how sometimes we feel like, oh, I don't want to eat that. I'd rather just die than eat that. Well, guess what? I'd rather eat this and die, but know that I'm not going to die because I will never be in this position again. If I can help it, which I can, I will never be in this position again. We can heal our bodies. We must heal our bodies. we got to be disciplined. And just like someone would say again, Ugh, I'm not going to go through all of that. I'm going to eat and be happy and die. Well, guess what? I'm going to eat and be happy and die. Just like you. Like my mom was talking about. Oh, I'll wait till you get here to make the juice and blah, blah. I'm like, really? Mommy, I thought you were smarter than that. Why would you wait for me to get home to do that? Um, yeah, so I'm going to have all of these vegetables here. I'm going to squeeze some lemon in there. And that's what I'm eating today. And you know what? I like being skinny. You know, I just like it. I like being the size I was when I was 21. And I've been able to do that because I was eating, you know, I've been eating healthy for the most part of my life. And I've always exercised and I've always been active. But sure enough, stuff happens, right? Yeah. But I'll continue because I get to stay skinny. And I like being skinny. Right now I'm a little bit too skinny. I'm like 125. I haven't been 125 since I was like 21 years old. But uh, anyway, let me eat, put some uh, something in my system. Love you all. Bye-bye. And it's God's way. Eating like this is God's way. It's how he has taught us to eat or told us to eat. And we just want to do things we want to do. We want to do it our way, the Western way. The Western way comes with consequences. God's way is for everybody. God's way, it's free for everyone. That's the crazy thing about it, is that you have to pay for medicines, but in this case, you don't have to pay. This is your medicine. Just organize it, 
research it, put it all together. Visit my um, Facebook, um, my note page. It talks about alkaline uh, foods. Alkaline in your body doesn't necessarily always mean cancer. It means from diseases, period. Foods that we should be eating, I have a whole list up there to keep your, your pH levels, Google pH levels. I can't explain it to you. I don't really, I just know it has to be above or somewhere seven point something. And, and when you have a, an, uh, a body that's alkaline, it doesn't allow toxins and things and diseases to, you know, um, take over your body. I want to say it, uh, doesn't allow the toxins to get into your system and give you diseases, whatever it is, cancer, diabetes, arthritis, the whole works. Okay, gotta go. I'll talk more later. Bye-bye.